Hello and welcome in. My name is Drumroll Tony. I'm a streamer on Twitch, musician, and music teacher living in Seattle. Elite Bata, it's been way too long. It's time to get back. I see he has a cover of Linkin Park's Numb. Now that is a throwback song. So that, that just takes me all the way back. So I'm excited to hear what he does with this. All right, let's go. He has so many different timbres, so many different sounds that go on to create, you know, kind of emulating the entire band and this very famous intro. Like, as soon as you hear it, it just takes you back. Like, I think uh, I went and looked at the original video really quick. It has like 2 billion views. This is, it shows you how popular that song was. Um, Okay, the biggest thing for me is the use of harmonics here and also just being percussive with all the different spots that we're kind of drumming on the guitar and tapping just to create different little sounds and nuances that let you know there's like still a percussion drum presence. So it's, it's very cool. Let's go back five seconds and I'll keep going. Here. so impressive for me is the chord melodies but these chord melodies are a little different right because you got to still play the harmonic functions you still got to play the melody but he's also doing the harmonic stuff that was there in the beginning and you're still tapping doing little not as much percussion stuff at the beginning but you're doing like four rolls still all in one that's why this is so in my mind so difficult and would be very difficult to emulate um I, i'm a horrible guitar player you know like i play very beginning guitar but when you see this kind of stuff it's super inspirational to think what can be done it's a one-man band right here man it's very cool So there's also an element of finger picking going on here too. Uh, I need that again. I think that was about 10 seconds back. Maybe not. know how to describe these because i don't play guitar anywhere near at this level but i like the variety and the harmonic um articulations that we're getting it's super fun i'm sure there's plenty of guitar there's probably real guitar player reactors that have nailed this way better than i could ever uh talk about it but i just want to say that i appreciate it i love hearing those different sounds because it's just it's so much more than just playing the guitar you're able to captivate and do so many more things in a as being the listener, it, you know, obviously it reminds you of the original song. It's the purpose. That's what a cover should do. But if you're going to cover a famous song, one of the main rules as a musician that you have to do is put a spin on it that makes your version of it stand out uh, and be, you know, just do that. Be different, but also be great. And he does this every single piece I've seen him do, whatever he covers. It's always amazing. And usually a very high level of musicianship. It's, it's just admirable. This is amazing. <laughs> Some 
nice little filler, man. A little, whatever, dark diminished scale that goes up and comes. That was beautiful. Let's get that again. I love that aspect. <laughs> It's, you know, I think one of the important things about um, being individual, ha like having individualism and being able identifiable, I feel like I'm uh, pretty comfortable at this point. If I didn't have video and you said, hey, and someone gave us to me, hey, listen to this cover and you played it for me, I think I could identify it as him just because of the style, the way he's going between harmonics, like full and half harmonics and the percussion that goes on on the guitar. I feel like we've heard that pretty consistent in his other um, performances. And I think that's a great thing. If you can identify someone by their playing, that's really, really amazing. And then again, falling back in the previous statement, if you're going to do a cover, you have to make sure that it has its own legs. And Elite Bata covers have their own legs, and they're very, very strong and creative legs. So that was amazing. That was a recommendation in my previous video. So I'm, I'm glad I'm glad you spoke up on that one. What else are we looking at? Tell me the next recommendation. My name is Drumroll Tony. I'm a streamer on Twitch. Make sure to catch me when I'm live so we can talk about Elite Batal, your favorite guitarist. You can find the link to my Twitch channel in the video description below, as well as the Discord server. If you'd like to support the channel, my Patreon information is also down below. Thank you so much for watching. I appreciate you. If you liked the video, please click that thumbs up button. Subscribe to the channel so you can catch the next upload. All right. Thank you so much. Take it easy. Bye-bye.